sanding heads. So they're smooth and beautiful. We're about to shoot uh, the first frames of the Shin's Rifles Spiral video. Time to begin. So we are about six weeks in on a stop motion music video. It's being shot in 3D, and it's for the Shins' uh, new song, The Rifle Spiral. We are just now introducing sort of the bad guys in the story, the which we call the Grimms, and it's these three magicians. And we are introduced to, to them on the train. And we're not sure what exactly is going on, but they have a bunny. Like we don't know why they want the rabbit. Um, it's sort of a mystery. I'm paying attention when I'm doing that, as I'm scaling it up to like what, what are the components of the drawing that I like and that make it work. When I was asked to write a treatment, uh, you know, I just listened to the song and I loved the, loved the track. I listened to the poetry of it and I, I wrote down words in a notebook that, that, that stuck with me and I, I kind of kept mulling over these phrases that, um, that James uh, was singing in the, in the song and, and just, uh, I just got these images that came up after a while. And then you, you, know, you, you jot down a couple images, draw little storyboards, and then you start to see connections between them. And, and then see, hey, is there a story here? And you, you kind of put in the last pieces, and that's that's my process. And then I take that to Alex, who is a great illustrator and fantastic storyboard artist, and he really brings it to life. He takes my little scratchy storyboards and, and puts Ad's character and life into them, and um, and then we cut that as a story reel to the music, make sure that it's it's flowing, make adjustments, and then just start shooting scenes and, and piece it piece it back together. The process of uh, setting up a shot, for example, this shot with the, the train going across the bridge, probably took about 12 hours uh, from the starting of setup all the way through the finished shot. Depending on how complicated it is, and how many characters there are, uh, it can take anywhere from an hour to two or three hours per second. Sometimes it would take 16 hours of animation to just do five or six seconds of screen time. It's just shooting one frame at a time, you know? I just couldn't get any more sort of brute force, you know, filmmaking. It's just carving a frame at a time. And uh, that in itself um, is a bit of a magic show, which I think that um, kind of ties into our, our theme of our, of our little film here. Is that I think that all of us in a way love the magic of you just you have this inanimate object and you you know work with it in the camera for a while and you bring it to life and every time we finish a shot and we all gather around um, animators done says okay I finished it I don't know what do you think we all come in and look and there's always this sort of like oh it's alive it's amazing you did it you made magic happen it's good right let's shoot new scenes now woo I think that makes it uh, exciting. <laughs> <laughs>